everybody welcome back as you can see we have a visitor today uh drew's here what are we doing drew Putting the clutch pedal in. i don't know if you can hear him but what we're doing is we're putting a clutch pedal in the is that way when we're ready to do the transmission swap this will be done um it looks pretty straightforward but you know how it goes on this channel it never goes like you think so drew's already started pulling the uh the old lexus apart got the lower kick panel off got some plugs out the way and uh looks like he's trying to figure out what else he's got to remove to get this here pedal in i know we got to do some cutting on the other pedals and do some other crazy stuff so we're gonna walk you through it and uh film as much as we can so let's get into it So let's see. That actually looks dry, Mike. It does look dry. This looks kind of dry. I don't think it's leaking from there, that's for sure. No. Nope. It might just be residual. Oh, that looks kind of dry too. Hey! Hey! <laughs> hey. That's, that's a good news. It is good that's news, good Mike. News, man. Yay! Means what we did. Yay! What? When did we do that? Like two, oh, two no. months ago? Two and a half oh, months no. ago? Ah. Uh, it worked. Yeah. We'll leave a link in the video. I think you made a video about this. Yeah, huh? I made a video yeah. on it. So, I think, yeah. Let's see here. It's like, you can kind of see it right there. You have to chase the booster up? It's like right there. See like the little hole for it? Bam. Yeah. Cut that and it should just fit in. So I had to go attempt to fix the vacuum cleaner. I'm gonna say attempt because I didn't get it fixed. It's broken, the belt's broken. I don't have a belt for it. Um, gotta order one, but so. Means I don't have to do that chore today. Excited. So we have to flip this over. True's mocking up the pedal. CAD, as Mike would say. Yeah, CAD, right there, bro. Cardboard assisted design. That's it. You thought it was gonna be fancy. Computer aided design. Nah, nah. Cardboard assisted. Cardboard assisted design. <laughs> so, it's marked like that. I guess we'll have to flip it if we're gonna drill from this side. have to do is cut this part out. Yes. Yes. This action. Just for your information, that's probably the worst pair of scissors on the planet. They're really hard to like actuate oh. and they're dull. <laughs> and then the little phalanges <laughs> are hurting. You can see the mark on them. All right. So we need to find a drill bit this size. And we got that weird hole thing. So we'll have to drill through this and then use this as a template because this was marked like so. We'll have to then take it and mark it like so. We'll have to put it directly like this into there. Get a angle drill to get in there where you saw um, between the strut tower and our friend this guy right here, he wanted to take a ride. So we're taking a ride with him. He's just super excited. Oh, we have the dollar wheels? Oh yeah, oh yeah. Hey. Hey. He's in there getting an angle drill and some other little knickknack stuff. Uh, we're in here with uh, the wild one. He is a, uh, he's a wild one. Uh, tried to let him out. Didn't bring his leash because didn't think he'd need to go out. He didn't. He just was amped up for no reason. I don't know what his deal is, but he's kind of chilled out now. He went running around in the shop like a mad dog. He's crazy. Tingo, are you crazy? He's crazy. What's our haul? Our uh, die grinder, angle bit, uh, angle drill, hole saw, which seems to be the right hole, I'd show you. And a couple step bits. Step bits and a center punch. Boom. Yeah. Should do the trick. Should give us the rooms we need. And this is for when we don't do it right. Okay. 
fix it. Tango. 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 Disc, disc. Hey, we got all the right stuff? We got all the stuff? Yeah? Okay. So, we made it back. Drew is center punching the hole so the drill bit doesn't walk. Should be something like that. Took what? I don't know. Ten minutes. Drill the holes. Enough. It was uh, quick, quick, quick. So you can see we got them in there. The fits perfect. I mean, it's almost like we knew what we were doing. Mm. Huh? Yeah. That that position right there is why under dash work is terrible. Right there. Just well, spine wasn't spine on the chassis. <laughs> it wasn't all stuff to go your way. It's even worse because it's like, why is this fighting me all of a sudden now? And then your arms get tired, oh, yeah. and then your neck gets tired, and you get real frustrated just <laughs> real fast. It's happening right now. Mm-hmm. So it's like, all right, dude, the ball's like right there. <laughs> Let's see, the frustration is happening. So Drew got the pedal in. Yeah. Those big noggins up in the way. Right. right there. Yeah, yeah. Now we gotta trim that brake pedal to make some room so we're not all fumbling while you're driving. Are you gonna put this all back together? We're we gonna put it all back together, guys, and then cut it? Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. True said, yeah. Modules back in right now. So no, 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 no connectors get any kind of like flying debris in them or anything. That was the hardest part of the whole job, getting that pedal bolted up. Clutch master, nice and secured. One step closer to putting the old five speed in this guy. last little thing you saw was us chopping it up um, it's not perfect but it's gonna do the trick it's gonna do the job as they say so it wasn't that bad I thought it was gonna be kind of a pain oh, but see, just cut right through it lines, it'll probably come out looking a little better yeah well you know here's what it is I mean if you wanted to we could like uh, we could take the grinder and round the edges but if, if you're not worried about it I mean it's you're never gonna notice when you're driving it, so it doesn't really matter. Mm -hmm. It's gonna, you know, it's gonna do the job. Them off. You know what I mean? So they want to like sharp on the edges. Yeah. Like the car by bit, and that was it. Yeah. I mean, we could make it look prettier, and maybe we do it eventually, but we'll get the trans and everything in and all that first. But that's gonna do the trick for sure. So now all Drew's got left is change that auto uh, shift boot out, center console piece. This dealio, this guy, 
Um, we'll swap that out and then he will have accomplished what he came here to do. Yeah. Good feeling. It's in. We got it. It's clutch master. Done. Hey, bro. Dude, man, I just whacked the crap out of y'all with that door. Dang. Pedals? Done. Center console? Done. So, all we got left on this thing to get it slide ready is to get a trans in there. Drew's got the trans, he's got the bell housing adapter, he's got the diff, needs a drive shaft. So, a couple weeks, we'll have the drive shaft, and then we'll be putting this tranny in here, and old Drusif back here is going to be a slidey boy, like the rest of us. And he's never going to be the same. So, that's going to do it for today, guys. If you liked the video, give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more, please consider subscribing. Hit that bell for notifications if you're really into the content. But as always, I appreciate you guys coming by and watching the video. Peace.